Hi there again, this is John Kelsey. Thanks for watching my video. I wanted to explain, you know what, people ask me a lot of times, how is it that estimating software works? And I just threw something up on the whiteboard here. I want to explain to you kind of an overview of how it works. Now, you should have by now watched a couple of the videos. You should have been able to create an estimate in a section and learn to start inputting materials into the estimate, okay? But listen, here's kind of an overview of it, okay? Here's how it works. When you sign up for Red Rhino, you, it, Red Rhino comes with a material catalog, okay? The material catalog lives in cyberspace, okay? Red Rhino is an online software program. I think you already know that. You can log on from any computer. It doesn't live on your computer. Let me digress on a story about that, okay? We've had several customers through the years that had their computers crashed. You know what would happen if you stored your estimates on that computer? Yeah, yeah, you lose all the, all the data. So Red Rhino is an online program. These guys called us and, and told us how thankful uh, that they were that Red Rhino is online because they didn't lose any data. They just go log in from a different computer, okay? They didn't crash. So I, I digress. But listen, Red Rhino has a material catalog with several thousand material items priced uh, in it, okay? Now, they go electronically and grab pricing on the cyber world and update that material price every month by the fifth of the month, okay? Now, the other thing that Red Rhino has is it has a labor catalog. The labor catalog has just labor only, labor hours it takes to install materials. It has it for thousands of items. All of the material, so, so, so here's how it works. I mean, let me digress here. Here's how it works. On your estimate, I'm going to step out of the way so you can see the whiteboard. On your estimate, I already explained that wizards and assemblies are the two kind of speed tools that we have, okay? Wizards and assemblies. And also there's a material catalog with thousands and thousands of materials in it. What you do when you drill down into it, you go to the material catalog. Now this doesn't depict how it looks on your computer, but you'll find conduit or boxes or devices, or you'll find Unistrat or Romex. You'll go find that material. You'll input the quantity, and I'm going fast on you here, but when you input the quantity, it spits out the labor and material cost in your estimate, okay? So when you go in, throw in 650 feet of Romex, it pulls the material price from the material catalog, it pulls the labor from the labor catalog, and it shows you total material price and total labor, okay? So that's how it works. Here's a material catalog, it has pricing, thousands of items, it's updated monthly, and it has a labor catalog, a catalog that's static. When you, put, when you say that you're going to install 650 feet of Romex, it'll pull how much labor it has for installing Romex here and show that in labor hours. Okay. Now I explained on the other video too that there's three major components of an estimate. Okay. There's the estimate, the recap, and the proposal. Now, I'm just going to cover the recap and proposal. Look, my objective now is, is kind of just to give you an overview how the software works, but explain to you why it's, it's, it works so darn fast, okay? So, so when you input a bunch of materials into the, the Rhino estimate, if you've watched the videos, you'll see you might have several hundred lines of materials, okay? Item by item by item by item. Okay, the whole time that you're inputting materials into the estimate, the program is creating a recap report, okay? And a recap is a summary of your estimate. And what, that, what I mean by that is, it'll show you the total number of hours that you have in your entire estimate and the total material dollars. Now, when you go to the recap, when you go there, you'll see video clips or a video at the top and you'll watch the videos for recap. But the recap is where you do your labor analysis. You analyze the job. The, the recap is where you'll input your expenses, like expenses for rental equipment, scissors lift rental, trencher rental, permit fees. Now, I'm, I'm throwing a lot out at you here. You'll see it all in the videos, though. And then when, it, when the recap comes up with a total price, which it will do with your markup, again, watch the videos, you'll understand this, but then, then those numbers transcribe to the proposal. Now, the cool thing about the proposal and the thing that makes it fast is we have some boilerplates in there for you, okay? Boilerplates for inclusions, exclusions, and qualifications. All that means is, is the proposal is a deliverable that goes to your client, okay? And so the numbers flow from the recap to the proposal to show the total dollars that your bid or estimate is, and then you build it and explain what's included. The inclusions means what's included in the price. 
the exclusions is what's excluded from the price, okay? And the qualifications, you qualify your bid. Now, as an, again, I'll let the videos explain all that, but they're boilerplates. So what makes it really fast, there's several components here, here. It has a material catalog with a pricing. It has a labor catalog with, with a labor for each item. There's thousands of material items in here. There's wizards and assemblies to make it super fast input. And then the estimate comes up with a total in the recap. And we have boilerplates in the proposal. That's the best I can do for telling you just real quickly how it works. I get asked that a lot. And so the main thing is, is that you start at the first videos and just go step by step by step. Watch them in order. It'll take you through all the steps. Estimate, recap, and proposal. You'll get really proficient this and bang out your estimates a lot quicker. Hope that helped. Uh, uh, you know, click, uh, click below here and uh, set up a 30-minute consultation with me, okay? I want to go over your estimates with you, answer any questions you have. I'm here for you. I love helping people. Take care. Talk to you soon.